Throughout America's history, small family businesses have been the cornerstone of our greatness as a nation. When you support a family business, you're not only making a purchase, you're investing in dreams, fueling passion, and helping build a generational legacy. I was reflecting on this when I heard the story of the family business operated by the mother-son duo of Vera and Frederick Mopkins of St. Louis. They worked shoulder to shoulder in their own small business, packaging and distributing the deadly synthetic opioid fentanyl. Their business operations were established at an extended stay hotel where Vera rented four rooms for operations. Vera handled the preparation and packaging of the product, and little Freddie managed sales. Unfortunately for Team Mopkins, word got out, and they began making sales to informants and undercovers working for the FBI and the St. Louis Police Department. Well, this gave the FBI probable cause to obtain a court-authorized search warrant for the four hotel rooms, where they recovered the drugs, multiple firearms, cash, multiple cell phones, and a 60-round drum magazine. A federal grand jury charged the mother and son with a variety of drug and weapons counts. They both pled guilty. Mama Vera was sentenced to 33 months in prison, and baby boy Freddy is going away for 10 years. Hopefully when they're released and the family is reunited, they can channel their entrepreneurial spirit into more productive businesses like multi-level marketing or timeshare sales. Subscribe for Daily Crime Stories. Have a great day, and be cool.